So if you want to know why the United States has been in a state of perpetual war pretty much my entire adult life, George Bush is going to tell you. And this is what's called a gaffe. A gaffe is when you accidentally tell the truth. Here it is. You want to know why we're at a state of perpetual war? Here it is. Here's, you're going to let the cat out of the bag. Uh, let's put it this way. Money trumps um, peace sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Isn't that funny? Ah, nice. Is it, you sometimes. Know, sometimes. All the time. But money trumps peace sometimes. <laughs> and he's the head of the free world laughing about it. If you really want to get yourself upset, what we're seeing right now all over social media when it comes to Israel, we didn't get that for Iraq. The internet wasn't there like it is now. That's right. Go back. Look at Assange, what he put out with the WikiLeaks with the, when it came to the Iraq uh, logs, when it came to what's going on, how our government not only lied about what was going on, how many people they tortured, how they you know, condensed the casualties. It will make you sick. And it's the same thing we're witnessing today. And I just want to say that because Assange is still in prison in Belmarsh right now, and there's no hope of him getting out. And he exposed what George Bush was laughing about right there. And, you know, they, they used to say Donald Trump was the enemy of the freedom of the press because he was rude to Jim Acosta. <laughs> and <he's, laughs> he said, oh, my God, he's he's against freedom of the press. He's an enemy. Meanwhile, both parties agree and Donald Trump agree on prosecuting the greatest journalist and most important journalist of our era, which is Julian Assange. And they're doing it right out in the open, yeah. right out in the public. And you assholes think voting for Joe Biden isn't voting for evil.